Hey guys, it's the Rav07 Tech Channel, and today we have a review of the Wild Charge wireless charging system. So, a Wild Charge is a revolutionary device that allows you to charge up to five devices at the same time, whilst also reducing the amount of cables needed to charge those devices. The pad costs around $50 in the US or around £40 in the UK but you can also purchase bundles which include the wild charge pad and also a skin for your device. The bundle that I have here comes with the pad and also this iPod touch skin and you can pick that up for around $80 in the US or around £60 here in the UK. So the charging pad itself is extremely thin and the overall design is very stylish and compact. On top we have several metal strips which act as the conductive magnetic surface. Now a lot of people have misconceptions when it comes to products like this and they seem to think that all you need to do is place a device on the pad and it will immediately start charging. But unfortunately that kind of technology isn't available yet. So with the wild charge you will need a skin or adapter to enable your device to be charged with the pad. Now this particular skin is compatible with all generations of the iPad Touch and it's essentially a rubber case with a difference. Inside you'll find that there is a 30 pin dock connector which you will need to connect to the iPod when installing the case. On the back we have four metallic points which create an electrical current when placed on the wild charge pad and this will initiate the charging of your device. So you can just install the case by inserting your iPod into the bottom and connecting the dock connector and then finally peeling over the rest of the case. The case is relatively easy to install and overall it's not too dissimilar to most other cases. Now the case gives us access to most functions of the device including the touchscreen, volume rocker switch and also the sleep wake button with the exception of the dock connector which is in fact in use by the case and overall that is a slight disadvantage because that means you have to remove the case if you wish to access the dock connector to sync your device. So the concept of the wild charge is for you to use the skin as an everyday case for your device and then when you come home from a day out or a day at work all you need to do is just simply place your device on the charging pad and it will begin to charge. Another cool thing about this product is that you can have your device set in any position or orientation on the mat and it will still charge. On the left we do have this little blue light which indicates when a product is being charged. And as I mentioned previously, the wild charge can charge up to five devices at a time. So now onto my conclusion. The wild charge wireless charging pad is definitely a promising looking product but it does have some flaws. One disadvantage is that the cases are only available for devices such as the iPod Touch, iPhone and Blackberry and if you do not own one of those devices you will need to purchase an adapter pack which are still pretty good but they're not as convenient as the cases. Another disadvantage is that the cases do not have a dock connection cut out and this means that you have to remove the case in order to access the dock connector. But one thing they could do is include some kind of mini USB port, possibly on the side of the case, so that you can still connect your device to a computer without removing the case. But overall, the Wild Charge is a stylish and compact solution for those who want to charge a multitude of different devices at the same time and also reduce the number of cables needed to do so. So, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed today's review. And remember to stay tuned to the RAV07 channel for more technology reviews.